Well, hi folks, uh, it's Michael once again, and I found something that is very useful. In the box here, I keep this old computer crap around, and uh, I ser searched for a network card uh, based on an RTL 8029 network controller, which I found here. Now, what I did is cutting it out, let's see, and ah, uh, gotta do something first. Uh, so it lies, and we want to salvage that that controller because you can use it for your VR um, uh, applications with your microcontroller. So, for example, to build a uh, embedded network controller, uh, an embedded web server, or something like that. So you can really use this uh, chip, and you probably won't get it just by itself. Uh, one tip. You can get those chips uh, on cheap network cards too, and those cards uh, cost about uh, three or four bucks. Um, this is, I mean, I suppose. And there, there are more useful parts on it. Yeah, there are some some more parts you can salvage. Oh, great! There are some more parts uh, on that thing you can salvage, and uh, so what we do. We have a flat iron here, and we use it to unsolder it. Um, this is the only proper way because if you use uh, hot air, it probably will ruin the chip because it's getting too hot. So we need about uh, 200 and wow, 250 degrees in that vicinity for uh, this to work. So uh, I've attached a. Uh, this controller, let's see how hot it gets. Um, it's getting, this is degrees Celsius. 100, 150. Uh, uh, yeah, I'd, um, yeah, it should, yeah, it should be enough. I mean, about 180, 200, sort of something. Could work, could work. Yeah, yeah, this could work. This could work. Yeah, okay, let's try it then. Ah, that iron smells somewhat awful. Ugh. Don't leave it on longer than it's really necessary. So. Ah, yeah, it's getting hot already. Pressing it on a little. Well, the iron is on the highest setting that is possible. Uh, still not quite. Not quite enough. Gotta put the camera away one moment. I'm putting it there, so maybe you can even see something. Yeah, yeah, no, it's coming off. Ah, I got it. Yeah, as you can see, <laughs> this is where the chip once was. 
Now this is the chip and uh, it looks really good. It looks really good. I mean the pins are not torn or anything like that. It's really good. In that condition you can really reuse it.